Hello, look what I've got. I've got 10 bucks. I'll show you the back. Is it real or is it fake? It's real, I think. Hopefully I got it at the bank a few months ago. But I have learned today about super dollars. And I don't have any here. Super dollars are $100 bills that are fake, but that look really, really real. And they're counterfeit so well that authorities have typically had a difficult time telling them apart. You have to be an expert to really tell. So the super dollars are created with the highest quality of ink on a cotton linen blend, just like normal $100 bills. And they have some of the same security features as regular $100 bills, including red and blue security fibers, security thread, and the watermarks. And there are many different varieties, but they're all really hard to identify. Um, one of the differences I learned about is that on the back of the $100 bill, unlike the 10, uh, we've got the U.S. Treasury building here, but on the back of the $100 bill is Independence Hall in Philadelphia, and apparently the clock on uh, the top of Independence Hall in the counterfeit uh, $100 bills, or the super dollars, has a different, uh, the hands look a little bit different. So, I don't know, check that out if you ever get a, a $100 bill. Um, in 2013, they made a new real $100 bill that is supposed to thwart even the counterfeiters who make the super dollars, but I think the super dollars are still in, in circulation. In 2005, five British guys were convicted of conspiracy to make counterfeit U.S. currency. They were tried and convicted in the U.K., but it was counterfeit U.S. currency or super dollars, the hundred, these fake $100 bills. They said, uh, the authorities said they recovered three and a half million dollars worth of fake $100 bills of excellent quality. And this group of guys, these five guys, said they were producing $500,000 in fake dollars each day. The police stated that, quote, the potential to undermine the economy of the UK and US was very significant. So they were making a lot of fake money every day. Where are the super dollars now? They're probably in circulation all over the world, but there are some hot spots, and one of the main hot spots is apparently North Korea. The US government has confirmed that North Korea has passed off super dollars uh, in various countries, in its dealings with various countries, and that super dollars circulate around North Korea and its bordering areas with China. And the U.S. Secret Service estimates that North Korea has produced about $45 million in super dollars since 1989. And they make them supposedly at the Pyongyang Trademark Printing Factory. Other possible places where they make super dollars are suspected to be Iran, Syria, and even the CIA is suspected of making super dollars. I don't know how true all of it is. This is just the research I did today, but I did learn what a super dollar is. I don't have any, I don't even have any real hundred dollar bills, but hope you've learned something interesting. And as always, I'll post a couple links if you want to learn more about this. Take care.